I was impressed with that move you pulled. Bang. Ladies, gentlemen, boys, and girls, children of all ages, it's me, it's G, it's Double MD, the undefeated, undisputed YouTube champion. That's right, it's the Maverick, Mark Daniels, here with episode 174 of our Borderlands 3 Let's Play. And guys, if you missed last episode, we finished up the Blast Plains. Let's take a look real quick. Uh, so all we have left is the Obsidian Forest, guys. So if we look here, Vestige, we're at 100%. Uh, we go back to Ashfall Peaks, 100%. Uh, Blast Plains, which we just did. Clicked on the wrong thing. Blast Plains at 100%. And then Blood Sun Canyon, 100%. And then, of course, Crater's Edge, 100%. So, all we have left here, guys, is the Obsidian Forest. If we look at our challenges here, we have a Satos Saga and a Satos Cash to get. And then we also have a Red Chest to obtain. So, not too bad. Not too bad at all. That's all we got to do. We also have one Echo Log. Which is next to a red chest. And that's actually the first thing we're going to try to do today. We'll see if that red chest is the one that we need. Spe especially since it's right next to an echo log. So we need to go to like right here. This area right here. So I think what we need to do is go around. Up and around I think. It's been a while since we've been here. So, oh yeah, it's this area here. I remember being here. Yeah. There's, uh, what's her name? Yes. It won't show me her name? Okay, well, who cares? So we need to find our way up. Hmm. We're also going to do the, uh, some bloody harvest stuff as well. It's basically just kill ghosts, and we're kind of doing that as we're playing. I may switch it back to mayhem mode, though. Because you have to kill ghosts in mayhem mode. You have ten token or nine tokens to redeem. Sure, we'll go mayhem level one. Because it doesn't have to be any higher than just level 1, I don't think, for this. Especially while we're just doing this easy stuff, it's not. it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Because we looked at this at the end of the last episode. There's 15 challenges. And I kind of want to do them. So we have, we just have to kill Haunted Badasses, that's no problem. Um, kill Captain Haunt 15 times. I might do some of that off camera, we'll see. Depends on how fast it is to do that. Um, collect Bloody Harvest Loot, we're pretty close to being done with that. Lawful Good Cleric, just kill Ghost. So here we go, we have to kill Ghost and Mayhem with 300 Ghosts. That might take us a little while. Uh, Nate's Hostile, just kill Haunted Borman Nate's, I'm not sure what these are all about. Loot Goals, um, equip three pieces of Bloody Harvest Loot at one time. Uh, loot a Bloody Harvest Legendary. Kill Captain Hunt with a Bloody Harvest Gun. Solve a pumpkin puzzle. Then kill haunted enemies with cryo damage in the heck hole. So at some point we need to go to the heck hole and get a cryo uh, weapon. We'll worry about that at some point. Grab some ammo. Alright, so we need to get... Let me go to the map again. So we need to get back... up here. Excuse me. Let me see where these are at. So the echo log is called Powerful Smells. 
beside the red chest. Use this telezapper to... Okay, so we have to use a telezapper. Okay, where's the telezapper located? So the telezapper that we need is definitely kind of away from where we're at. Let me just maneuver this map around just a hair. Okay. I think this is right. So the telezapper that we need is over here. It's not that far away. I'm going to give it the wrong marker. So we're looking for a telezapper over here. Assuming I marked the right thing. <laughs> Which I'm not seeing a telezapper, so I may not have. like hiding I'm look at the map again all right so if we look at the map I did look at the wrong thing by the way all right so we got this down here okay, okay. so the telezapper over here I did I go went to the wrong area my bad So chances are, then, that means this is probably the red chest we're missing. Now, what's the easiest way to get over there? Which, if it is the red chest we're missing, that makes our life a lot easier. does a lot of damage. There it is. There's the Echolog, and here's the red chest. I smelled you coming a mile oh, Letta, away, that's her name. Rose. Wasn't trying to hide it. You know why I'm here, then? I've heard you've got a way with the devils, but it won't work with the one you're after. How do you know? Mm, that's a nice looking this grenade. Company would still be here. I can control it. I know it. It's in my blood. So I already equipped it. I just want to compare them real quick. So the the grenade that we were originally using does less damage, but has a bigger radius, and the uh, incinerary damage does more. Oh, it's a mayhem level ten grenade. That's why. Yeah, we'll keep our uh, old grenade. Okay. Sorry about that, her whistle is loud and hurts my ears. I remember that melody. Now, while they're doing that, that was the red chest we were missing, by the way. While she worked, in fact. But that was a long time ago. You be careful out there, Rose. In my experience, you can't really tame a devil. Best you can do is turn its attention to something else for a time. If it gets hungry, it'll eat you all the same. All right. So now we see the the uh, the Sato Saga or the journal and the cash. So let me just maneuver the uh, the map. Okay. So the so the cash that we're missing is over here, or not the cash? Sorry, the journal that we're missing is over here. So let's head on over there. Map. 
need to get down below. I feel like if I go this path, I can jump down. going on in here if I go this one take a left Clap, boys. Follow the devil rider into the forest. Saw him go into a hut littered with all sorts of hunting equipment. Don't know what they were doing in there. All right, so then the uh, cache, it should pop up on our map, but it should be like in this area. Yeah, like. Like over here. But afterwards, it seemed like the devil was here too. Strange. Ruth Kanara said she heard some scientist from the company days that the one we rode up, the place was abandoned. Maurice, thought you were kidding about the ghost thing, but uh, I just found one. To collect the ectoplasm. Oh, there it is. Beautiful. We could check the mail, by the way. Um, here we go. So this is all the stuff they've sent us. Um, oh my god, look at that. 717 item score. Some room decorations. So we got a couple rocket launchers, an AR. Are there ARs better? Uh, pistol. Got a new emote. I'm looking to see if we have any uh, cryo weapons. Doesn't look like it. Our pistol does a little bit more. That's all right. Let's go ahead and sell this stuff. You've got enemies and I've got ammo. No question asked. Happy to help. All right, so we're done with this area. We're completely done with Jehenna. 100%. Very nice, guys. Um... Where are we at on time? 14 minutes. So I don't want to start the next DLC just yet. Um, I mean, we could just go around killing stuff for the uh, Maurice mission. We could try a takedown mission. Probably not in 15 minutes, though. We just got to collect uh, Hectoplasm. 
So where should we? I don't even know where to go to hunt stuff down. What would be the best place? Probably like the blast plains, right? Just a big open area. Oh jeez. Go big mounty boys. No ghost yet. Oh here's one. Go back here. I think I went to a different travel, but that's fine. Nope. Let's grab a catcher ride. Um, I'm not really sure where to go. Trying to remember where there was a lot of enemies over here, right? Oh god. Ready to unleash this power. Quicker than I thought. Whatever, I feel like now that I'm looking for ghosts, I'm just not finding any. <laughs> um, I don't know where to go. 
trying to think. Where was Ashfall Peaks? Maybe like in the uh, like this area. Just looking for a bunch of enemies in one area. Grab some ammo. I am the I'm stuck. Oh god, we're taking so much damage. Crap, kill the ghost. Rocket launcher. All right, item list. Does it say if this stuff is from the uh, bloody harvest? Where do you have this? We drop it. Cause you have to equip three pieces of gear from the bloody harvest event. All right, let's go talk to uh, Maurice, since we have the uh, ectoplasms. Now, we did do this last year with the uh, Bloody Harvest. We didn't do the challenges, but we collected all the plasm and stuff and did... Uh, little area that we get to do the uh, what's it called the heck hole yeah so we can enter the bridge All right, I'm just going to ask why did you need ghosts Maurice has tracked the source of the haunting the ghost school will open a gateway you will go to this hole of heck and kill the hateful fiend who has unleashed these ghosts. I just wish we had a cryo weapon. Maybe we can buy one. Let me go to Maurice's real not Maurice, uh, Marcus's real quick. We could also gamble until we get one as well. Because we got to kill, was it 50 ghosts with cryo damage in the whole effect? Something like that. Got a nice little pistol. I don't know what we'd do without the Crimson Raiders. Die, probably. Oh, fuck. I thought that was a health pack. It certainly wasn't. <laughs> oh, wow, I didn't want anything. We can go down to Ellie's real quick. There's a, a shop down there as well.
the shotgun has cryo damage. So this is AR. It's a lot of points. I don't really care though. If I'm being honest. Alright, um... Take a look at it. Shoots nicely. Fully auto or semi auto. Okay. Are we out on time? We got about four minutes. I think what we'll do next episode is do some of the Bloody Harvest stuff. We might go down to the heck hole and complete it in Mayhem. I think we'll try to do some of these challenges. I don't know if I'll do everything on camera just because we have to beat this like 15 times, which is a lot. <laughs> I might try to do it off camera a few times. But we'll do at least one. So I'm coming in here real quick just to kill some stuff, but... We have to kill ghosts, right? Oh, we've completed a challenge already. What do we do? Oh, just collect bloody harvest loot. Okay. Um, so we have to do... It's 50. I know that much. Kill haunted enemies. So they don't even have to be ghosts. Just haunted enemies in general. Okay. I thought it matters too much. As you see, we have been here before. We have done this before. I don't remember exactly what they're like with the bosses and stuff but I remember doing this at the very least I'm oh, this gun's not too bad at all it's pretty good that's a loot ghost definitely want that Ooh, baby let's go sniper rifle couple sniper rifles actually Oh, that guy's a big boy. Oh, it's been a while since we fought one of these guys. With a thing on their back. That has been a while, man. Nice. Oops, I didn't mean to shoot. Trying to see if it said it was a, a bloody harvest deal. Let's go around, huh? It's been a while since we fought one of these guys too. My goodness. Find some of the old enemies. Alright, so let me take a look at some of these items. So we have That's the that's not that. Okay, so here's a cryo weapon. Ah, oh, we wasted our points. Well, terrified reduce. Okay, so I think it's just the fact that they have the terrified abilities. That's a nice SMG, though. Honestly. Uh, this one does more damage. Weapon charge. Okay, what happens if I. Equip this stuff real fast. Give me a minute. Did they give us the challenge? I think it did. Yep. Okay, perfect. So that's out of the way. And I don't remember which shield we were wearing. Was it this one? Yeah. Cool. 
then in this SMG, we had a different SMG. This one. Okay. I wanted to see something else real quick before we end the episode. Kill Ghost in Mayhem mode, we're at 14. And then kill Root Ghost, that's going to take a little while. Kill Haunted Enemies with Cryo Damage in the Heckles. We haven't even got any of these. Interesting. Specifically with Cryo Damage, is it? Like, we're using cryo weapons. Interesting. Do I have to just let them, like, freeze to death? I don't understand. So he's only taking fire damage. This actually might be tough to do because they're taking so much different types of damage, uh, damage from me. So if we go over here, any progress on that yet? No. Interesting. Interesting. Can I change my ults to do ice damage? See, this makes it corrosion damage. Incinerary. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, guys, that's going to be the end of today's episode. Next episode, we'll come back. We'll do the Bloody Harvest stuff. Uh, we'll finish the heck hole here. I'm going to try to figure out maybe the best way to kill these guys with cryo weapons. If I need to change my talent tree up a little bit or what, we'll figure that out. But thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I'm the Maverick Mark Daniels. Bidding you farewell. Peace and one love. Bye!